All right, guys. Um, you guys are welcome. Today we'll be talking about um, contents of the digastric triangle, and um, digastric triangle is actually widely known as a submandibular triangle. Okay. So most of the times when you go online and search the digastric triangle, you might barely see some useful stuff on it. Okay. Because most people refer to it as submandibular triangle because of course it's below the mandible. Okay. So the question is focus is for us to derive the mnemonics to remember the contents of this triangle remember we made a video talking about the anatomy of the digastric triangle already okay so a uh, video to like uh okay video to derive uh the mnemonics that can aid us remember the contents of this triangle right so um the contents of this triangle are here the mnemonics is here right but now let's look at the contents first in the triangle before we come back all right so we have facial vein right here we have facial vein and artery all right so we have facial vein um we have submandibular salivary gland this is a submandibular salivary gland anything i cycle just trace the line down okay but we have the submandibular lymph nodes i don't think they are indicated all right, submandibular lymph nodes not indicated. And this picture right here, I'm not using it because this picture is mainly just to show the muscles, not the content. Okay, this one describes the content better. So, um, the mylohyoid nerve, and um, well, mylohyoid um, nerve is not okay. So mylohyoid artery and nerve okay then lastly we have the hypoglossal nerve okay hypoglossal nerve or hypoglossus nerve the same thing all right so guys now having pointed out everything in the uh, triangle that's the digastric triangle we'll come back and relate the mnemonics to what we have listed okay so first mh that's how i call it first mh F S S M H. Okay, so instead of saying F S S S M H, you say F S M H. But you now, since you have watched my video and you have the knowledge, you know how to write the F S. Okay, so F S M H, F S M H. All right. So the F is what facial vein. F S S is what submandibular salivary glands. Um, sec uh, the, to uh, the second S is what submandibular lymph nodes the m is what mylohyoid nerve the h is what hypoglossal nerve okay so repeat after me first mh first mh first mh believe me mnemonics will help you a long way so that you don't mix stuff up right you might know it but you won't even remember that this is for this this is for this all right but mnemonics will help you clearly differentiate things okay like for this, you don't mix up the structures found in submandibular triangle and the posterior triangle of neck. You don't mix up the stuffs found in submandibular triangle and occipital triangle. There are so many triangles, right? So you can't afford trying to actually know the structures name by name and not using the mnemonics, right? You end up being confused, okay? So guys, that's it about the mnemonics to actually remember the contents of the diagastric triangle, also known as the submandibular triangle, okay? So see you guys pretty soon.